Hello, thank you for joining me. So in this film, the uh, third film in our series on building the stairs, these are linear stairs. What we've done in the previous film is build our stairs from the first floor, made modifications to it so it lined up to the walls on the first floor. And now we're going to have our do our stairs on the second floor, make modifications to the second floor in order to accommodate the stairs coming up. So it's really kind of kind of weird if you take a camera view. Let's go ahead and do that. These camera views and section views are good when you're putting your stairs in. Just make sure you have everything lined up. It's appropriate right now just to do a camera view, so we're going to go to our 3D view on our view tab. You go to camera, okay, save the product, project, and we're going to take a look at what the stairs look like. So here's the second floor, if we stretch that out a little bit. <coughs> you notice it doesn't really show the back of the house. You know how to adjust that, right? So if you go to our 3D view too, double click on that, oh, yeah, we're already there, but go to the first floor, take our 3D view and tell it to show that camera. Let's go to the second floor show the camera, there's the camera it doesn't really show the back of the house but if you took that view depth and move that back there now we can see the back of the house let's go back to that uh, two, 3D view too and now we can see it so the weird thing about it is you got these railings that come out of nowhere <laughs> up, to the, up to the second floor what we really need to do is kind of cut out the second floor in order to accommodate the stairs so the stairs, not just the railings, pop out of the floor the stairs don't really do really never pop out of the floor necessarily, but you should be able to the kind of like levels of floors that go down, so it never goes below this second floor level. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's go to our second floor, and what we want to do is select that second floor. And sometimes it's tricky. If you have a, a floor like this, we actually have elements, lines in here that are selectable. It's easy. If it's a like a nondescript floor, like a um. um you know, a floor that isn't really defined with any material, finished material on top, and it is kind of hard to select. And there are methods of doing that with the tab key and go to the edge of the wall in order to do that. Okay, so we have a floor selected. Edit boundary. And what we have is enclosed geometry, this uh, large rectangle with a cutout for a front door. And what we want to do is uh, cut, uh, draw some more lines that have enclosed geometry within enclosed geometry. So we're going to click the line button. And what we want to do is click on the edge of the stairs there. Go to the wall over here. Go over here. There, perhaps. Now let's just have the landing included as well as the stairs that come up from the landing. And up. Oh, it's not really quite what we want. Again, just like anything else, when we have that magenta line coming out, we could always move that around and lock it and do all sorts of good stuff. It's nice to be able to lock that to the floor, so if you're in a design mode and you're moving the stairs around, that cutout for the second floor will move too. So the way you do that is you click on that, move that line back and forth perhaps. If it isn't apparent, go ahead and lock it into place. As you're drawing it out, it gives you that option to draw it to lock it too. So, oh, being difficult here. We're going to lock that and so on and so forth, just for demonstration. Okay, let's go to check mark and see what it looks like. And because we made a mod modification to the floor, it's going to ask us again, would you like the walls that go up at this floor as level attached to its bottom? And that is yes. So our first floor walls will terminate there. And now that's our stairs there. So let's go to our 3D view of our camera. And let's rename that. We'll call that uh, second floor. Second floor stairs. So we know what we're looking at. Stairs. Stairs. And go to OK. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, that looks a lot better. And yeah, we're going to have a big kid's room up here, so we're probably not going to put railings up here because I'm going to fall into that well. No, we really want to have railings, so I'm going to show you how to do those railings in the next video.